Just before we go to the pitch tonight, something you should know. We recorded this segment a couple of weeks ago, but we can only show you one of the ads involved in the challenge. I'll explain more afterwards. Now, the pitch, where two leading ad agencies take the challenge of selling the unsellable. The winner receives this Gruen trophy made from fair trade, rainforest-friendly plastic. <laughs> now, to be overweight these days is to run the gauntlet of public disapproval and humiliation. So tonight we've asked our agencies to do a genuine public service and come up with a campaign for fat pride and add to make plus-size Australians feel better about it. Can they do it? Please welcome from JWT Melbourne, Richard Muntz. <laughs> and from the foundry in Sydney, Adam Hunt. Thank you. Thank you. Now, Richard, this was, this was a tough challenge. How did you attack the problem? Uh, being, in a, in, being in a recession, we thought... <laughs> <laughs> we need more consumers. Fat might just be the thing to get us back in the black. Well, let's have a look. The stock market, unemployment, housing prices. We're in recession. But there is one group of people who can save us. Super consumers. You consume 18% more than thin people. And right now your nation needs you to do what you do best. Consume. Because of you, farmers grow more food. Because of you, XXL clothes are made. And because of you, airlines burn more fuel to get you off the ground. If everyone upsized like you, Australia would already be in recovery. Thank you, thank you, thank you, you supersized superheroes. Uh, we did shoot the rest of the pitch segment, but the ad from the Foundry, which may be highly offensive to some people, has not been approved for broadcast by the ABC, so we can't show it to you here. For the record, on the night, the panel judged the JWT ad the winner in a three-to-one vote. We at Gruen feel that while the Foundry ad may be potentially upsetting, it was made to be a legitimate approach to the problem, with a sincere intent to persuade Australians to reconsider their prejudices. If you wish, you can see it at this website, www.antiprejudicedad.net, along with an explanation from its creator and a panel discussion about it. Gruen, normal service will be resumed as soon as possible. <laughs>